Welcome to Arlington in Two, a review of local news, events, and more. A man is arrested for allegedly selling drugs near an Arlington school. Arlington police arrested Michael J. Bowler late last week, charging him with selling heroin near the Audison Middle School. Bowler was arrested after detectives conducted an undercover drug buy from the suspect. Bowler is charged with distribution of a Class A drug, heroin, committing a drug violation near a school, and possession of a Class A drug. The developers of the Mugar land will meet with residents to go over plans for their proposed 186-unit housing complex. Oak Tree Development will meet with residents and members of the Coalition to Save the Mugar Wetlands to explain their idea for a 40B housing project. The housing would take up seven acres of the now open 17-acre lot. The land is located along Route 2 in East Arlington. For years, the town has not wanted the site developed, but under 40B affordable housing laws may not have many options. The Mugar meeting is on Thursday, May 21st at the Hardy School at 7 p.m. Arlington Public News will be there to cover it. Democrats in Arlington will be holding a caucus at the Senior Center to elect delegates to the Massachusetts Democratic Convention. 36 delegates will be elected along with six alternates at the May 19th meeting beginning at 7 p.m. The convention will be held in September in Springfield. The meeting is open to any registered Democrat in Arlington. For more information, visit arlingtondems.org. Arlington will be holding its annual Memorial Day Parade on Monday, May 25th. The parade kicks off at 9.30 in the morning from Adams Street at Massachusetts Avenue and continue to Monument Park in Arlington Center for a wreath-placing ceremony. The parade will continue to Mount Pleasant Cemetery to honor the men and women who proudly served our country. I'm Erin Dixon and that is Arlington in Two.